Godspeed and party on. Spencer Lazari here with Tim Kennedy at Strike Force. Just be Melvin Manhoff. Relatively easy win. Obviously feeling good right now. Yeah, I feel great. You know, the best part about wins like that is um, Monday I'm back in my gym. So who would you like to fight next? I know you just mentioned Robbie Lawler is who you'd like to see. Yeah, definitely. You know, that, that's um, Jacare is the number one guy in Strike Force, and in the rankings, top 10 wise, you know, he's number one in Strike Force. Number two is Robbie Lawler. So, matchup wise, he's very explosive, he's very dynamic. Um, I think we just match up and it'd be an exciting fight for the fans. And then you've also got, of course, Mayhem maybe is the other outside chance of a guy you might fight. Talk about possibility of that. You know, Mayhem, man, what, what, he, he and I fought twice in both those fights. Um, it's two of the three times I've ever been to the judges, and both times were, we're bloody messes. Both of our faces were all beat up. It's the fights that people, it's, it's the Stefan Bonner force Griffin fight. It, that's the fight that happens every time. I don't know what it is about Jason and I. We just go out there. You're not going to knock us out. Um, you know, we're just going to sit there and beat each other in the face until somebody says, that guy won. I think he's <laughs> less beat up. Totally unfinishable. Yeah. So we know about the Afghanistan strike force sending this stuff to Afghanistan. How cool is that for you to be a part of being an Army Ranger? You know what? As soon as I get back to my phone, I'm going to probably have one or 200 emails from troops overseas. They, they shut down defects, a, a cafeteria um, overseas, and they put the, the fights on for the, for the troops there. I got Green Berets in almost every single country that are going to be emailing me tonight being like, hey, dude, saw your fight. Miss you, you know? Uh, you know, this country, sometimes it gets a little disheartening to see everybody caring so much about uh, Charlie Sheen or something as opposed to what's going on overseas and how hard these guys are fighting. So how important is it for you to get that notoriety being in the armed forces yourself? Man, the um, America's America, you know, like those guys over there, they know how ridiculous the 300 million people in this country are, um, but they're still over there dying and bleeding and starving um, to protect the constitutional right that the people have to live in ignorance about what they do over there so they can, you know, enjoy the luxuries of their home and, uh, you know, follow Charles, Charlie Sheen on Twitter. So um, I'll do it. You know, I love America and I'll be over there doing the exact same thing. I might be a little like, hey, why don't they get a grip on what's really important? But, you know, it, life is what it is. Okay. Well, I really appreciate the time. Great fight. We look forward to seeing you in the red next uh, Tim Kennedy here at Strike Force. Thanks. Godspeed and party on.